release Unam de Kano at the next hearing. The Chief Justice of Nigeria speaks. Fixed dates for the next hearing. Okay, my people, um, the next hearing for Mazen Unam de Kano's freedom has finally been fixed. And um, the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Keke Ryoku, and as as um, intervened and interfered uh, in this case and um, telling um, uh, uh, the court and then the the chief just the the, the judge uh, that um, the uh, Niaku to do all within a power to see that that very case is concluded and now the canal is granted his freedom. All right. Now let's quickly go straight to the content, my able listeners. This is today's news. The Court of Appeal, sitting in Abuja on Thursday, adjourned to October 31st hearing of an appeal. The indigenous people of Biafra IPOP filed to challenge its prescription as a Boko organization by the federal government. A three man panel of the court okayed the hearing date after it directed the parties to file and exchange all the necessary legal processes in the matter. The detained leader of the IPOP, Namde Kanu, had earlier applied to be joined as an interested party in the appeal mat. Specifically, IPOP, through its lawyer, Mr. Ifai Ejofo, is praying the appellate court to set aside in its entirety the ruling final decision of the late former chief judge of the federal high court justice abdul abdul kafarati which on september 15 2017 outlawed its activities in nigeria it will be recalled that the high court prescribed ipop on the strength of an ex parte motion the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Mr. Abubakar Malami San, filed on behalf of the federal government. Justice Kaparati specifically declared as illegal all activities of the group, particularly in the southeast and south south region of the country. He further restrained any person or group of persons from participating in any of the group's activities. The judge directed the AGF to ensure that he published the only prescribing IPOP in the official gazette as well as in two national dailies. In a follow up ruling on January 22, 2018, the court dismissed a motion IPOP filed to challenge the legal validity of the prescription order, which it said was suspiciously obtained by the AGF. On this note, the AGF of Nigeria has also pleaded for an appeal to be made and fired for this case. The Chief Justice Kekireko has called for a quick ratification of this trial, ordering the freedom of the IPOP leader by the next hearing. Thank you for listening to today's news. Yes, so my people, don't be smart. And this is what we want. And this is what's uh, supposed to happen. Exactly. This is what's supposed to happen. I congratulate Mazen Namdekano because you know he's a, you know he's a, in fact, um, his freedom is going to do a lot of things. It's going to help uh, Nigeria. Even Nigeria as a country is going to help them. But I don't know why Nigeria does it do what they do so. But meanwhile, I know what her lack. Now, them, everything did their hand. So, um, anything they want to do, may then do. That's so, my people. All right, so based on what has just been said as we speak right now, um, I would really like to hear from you and also to know what your opinions and what your take on what has just been reviewed right now on this matter. We are heading to the top. <laughs> All right, don't forget to click on the red subscribe buttons as well. Ask the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.